Hello, my name is Karx82, and welcome back to my Craig Tech New Horizon series. Just uh, mining out a redstone vein here. Um, so I got about a stack in a bit, and I got some ruby and cinnabar, so... All good, I just slept because it was night out, and some of the monsters had spawned. <laughs> so I'm trying to get them to spawn. I did find, uh, while I was doing this... Emerald ore here. Um, I can't mine it yet though. I need harvest level four and I'm only at three. So can't mine that yet, but uh, it does apparently spawn in by itself. I thought it only spawned in. Actually, let's, let's take a look. So there's this one. Is there any other? Yeah, like I was, I figured like maybe that's. Yeah, beryllium vein. And quite a lot spawn in that, those veins. Lapis vein. Oh, that's DD. I don't know which one that is, but... Yeah, so 5 to 30. Does that not spawn? That might not spawn in the overworld. I don't remember. Which one said it? Uh, yeah, I don't remember. All right here. So yeah, Overworld is OW, which I figured. What's DD? Deep Dark, Under Dark. All right. So that's cool. But uh, yeah, if I need at least like one emerald, I can get uh, get some more right there once I can mine it. All right. But anyway, just figured I would. Show that. And I can't wait to be able to get ladders. I just like to have this whole thing lit up. So monsters don't just kind of randomly. I've had them walk down and. No, that's not what I want. Yeah, I've had them like walk down the stairs and start attacking me. And uh, torches aren't. Really, that difficult to get anymore. All right. So also, I think that's enough of these. Still haven't gone exploring. I have decided. I think I haven't really gotten too much into this. I guess we could run. Um, maybe doing a base, kind of over the water. Now usually I do like a the main floor and then underneath I'll do like a basement, but I'm thinking maybe like the basement level will be this and then I'll go above it maybe. I I don't really know how I'm going to tackle that if I'm out over the water. Because I figure I don't I mean I could like just build down. Like if we look like I am actually like out over the water. I'm not. Um, but I guess, I mean, if I really wanted to, I could just fill it in and then, but I don't know if I want to do that. So, uh, yeah, I have to build out the platform. Obviously, I don't have any, there's no builder's wand. Or at least I'm not able to get it yet, I don't think, actually. This is just stone. Large plates can't get that, so that's steel screws, so definitely can't get that. I think got stone plates, uh, compressor, which I'm actually working towards, so that's actually not. Which one? Am I? That one, stone plate, yeah. So why is there two of those? Craig Tech, Craig Tech New Horizons, like, <laughs> with the same recipe? It seems a bit weird. Anyway. Um, yeah, I'm actually working towards that. So maybe once I get the full slate of steam machines, I will build out the rest of the platform. I'll get the builder's wand because that just helps so much with uh, with building. All right. All right, so I need eight of those. That's kind of what I was going for for that quest. Actually, didn't mean to break that. I hit the wrong button. Oh well. 
All right, so let's put that away. Put that away. Grab them, and I'll just throw all this stuff in here. All right, so let's take a look now at the steam age. I could get a backpack. That's maybe a thing to look into. I think it holds 16. No, oh, just regular backpack, the forestry backpack. Yeah. So there's diggers, which holds like dirt and stone and stuff like that. And then the miners is ores, I believe. What is that? Yeah, just some leather, tan leather. Not the cheapest, um, but not too difficult. But anyway, uh, let's kind of move on here. So now I've got that much steam. So I got plenty of steam going on. So why don't we, I'm gonna need bronze. So let's do, how about, that's eight, right? All right, so hopefully that's not too loud. I don't know if I can turn that down. Yeah, so I don't know. That may, may have done it, may have not. Uh, but as we can see, we are draining steam. Um, but that is... Have we have such a backlog now? Okay, so... That's the thing. I was a bit worried about that. And the reason that just did that is because I don't, those pipes aren't big enough. Let's disable that. It fills up with, should fill up. Oh, no, just kidding. Let me turn that back on. I need a vent on top. There we go. Always got to have the vent open on top. But I don't think those pipes underneath are going to be supplying enough if I have the whole line. All right. But anyway, let's move on here. So it wanted me to get redstone. I thought that. I sworn I had all that. Oh, did I not have? I probably don't have 16 cinnabar. No, I only have 10 cylinder bar. That's a bit annoying. Let me go get... Oh, it's not. It's optional. Let me go get the rest of the cinnamon bar really quick. All right. One death later, I got... <laughs> I think... So concentrated essence berry. I should probably take this. I don't know if there's any other way to get it. So kind of just taking all those just in case I end up using those because um, you can use them to like grow. So I'm just going to leave those and then Yeah, maybe eventually we'll get around to using them. Okay, so moving on. So what is this? Are you wondering how to process your redstone without a macerator where you can mine it and get crushed ore, then use the hammer and a crafting table to get impure dust, and thus fill the cauldron with water and then drop dust in it? Control Q drops the whole stack. Yeah, that's good to know. All right, so this is how you clean off your, your impure dusts now. Can you not... Smelt this. No, okay, you can't smelt it to like five redstone. Just kind of hoping you can do that. All right, so what is the cauldron looking like? Just a bunch of iron and a hammer. It's not too bad. Except I'm running low on iron, aren't I? Pyrite. Smelts down to iron. Hmm. 
I think. Yeah, okay. Second, I didn't remember. All right, um, actually, before... I'm just thinking, wants me to make these red oil ingots is kind of what we're working towards, but the forge hammer. Maybe I should go for that first. Wait, I probably can't get these, can I? Nope, I can't do, I have to have a compressor first before I can get that. Compressor. Steam compressor I can get. Because um, I feel like I should be going that first because now I'm like, I have to craft this cauldron. So I'm like wasting the plates, my iron. Whereas I should be Man, I just realized that forge hammer. That is five blocks of iron. Whew, that's a lot. 45. 45 ingots there. Um, yeah, I'm not going to do this quest yet. I don't. Well, I need it. To do this one, don't I? I don't know if I. I don't know if I kind of agree with that progression. Like, why is it telling me to get the red alloy before the other machines? Is that just to move on? Because you use it to get. Which use it for like, yeah, like the wires. Isn't that what the reason to get this? Or is it the plates that it wants? The only thing I'm like, if I don't, if that gives me red alley, what does this give me? Redstone. I think I'm going to deviate from the quest line just a bit to get the forge hammer and compressor kind of first so I can get some better efficiency on my ingots. Yeah. yeah. So that's 16 ingots and then oh just kidding I need a piston which I need red alloy plates. All right so that is a thing. <laughs> All right. So, as always, should just be following me. The quests. I didn't think about the... Yeah, I never thought about the, the piston being a different recipe. Um... Oh, right there. Can I reach? I'm going to burn myself with a jump on there. No. I can't reach. <laughs> I can't reach. All right, so there is that. Cauldron and hammer, do I? No, it's a retrieval. Is that not gonna like, well, maybe I have to have them both in hand because I didn't actually put this in hand. All right, so there we go. So we put the cauldron down, put water in it, and that'll be three. We get three uses from that. 
now I believe I have to yeah and you get five from this with a the forge hammer is like if I just put a hammer to it I think I can just do this can I uh oh do I need to actually physically break it I might actually have to break it. There might not be a recipe for that. It wants, it wants a lot of that. It wants. Got all the, uh, all the fireworks going off here. Fifty-five. I think that is sixty-four, isn't it? Yep. All right. So there is the crushed. This one, I think you can do. Yeah. It does use sixty-four uses from your hammer. So, ouch. Tonight, let me sleep. To avoid uh, 50 million things spawning. All right, and then you can just throw everything in here and it washes it. And there is that. Redstone, don't really need. Let's just get a loot bag. Um, yeah, I'm going to open this. And I am happy I did because that's really good. All right. So this one's two stacks of redstone. Get some redstone or on your pick, shovel, or axe to make it faster. Yeah, I'm not going to do that yet, though. Now, red alloy ingots uh, are one see how many does it want 14 so it's one in four right or is it one in one? Oh, it's one in one all right i feel like that was different in another version that I have done. I thought that was... Oh no, I guess that is nerfed. One redstone, four ingots gets you four redstone ally, I think, but yeah, it's been nerfed. It's a one-to-one -one now. Alright. Might as well break that down. Now if I, I did a whole stack with before, if I just do that, it uses one of the uses, you get three, and I only got one from that. So it definitely makes sense to do stacks at a time. Alright, so I want to finish this quest because I want to see where it's taking me after this. And I definitely need to work on my armor. Because I'm tired of getting like one shot. Those uh, brutish, brutish zombies and brutish skeletons. Holy cow, brutish skeleton! Yeah, basically one shot me. It hit me down to half a heart. Um, so then I was moving slow because I was dying, and then I actually died. Should I keep this going or? I don't know. Let me throw. Because I am sort of wanting to move this relatively soon, so I don't want to. But this stuff is so easy to get. Tons of coal, I could just throw it in there and get more, so I'm not overly concerned. Okay. So there is my red LA ingots. Let's complete that. I guess we'll take that. 
Small gears require a wire cutter to be made, so let's craft one. And I will make a furnace too, but uh, I want to get this stuff first. Okay, so what do I need? Three plates, two rods, and one screw. So. What did I say? Two rods. Three plates. And let's cut that. And then file it down for the screw. And the wire cutter is. Push that wood. Not be there. Hammer, file, screwdriver. I think that's what I said. Yep, there is that. And this spider is a bit annoying. This is a big one. Yeah, giant spider. Give me two string though, but that hissing drives me nuts. Okay. So what was there? Okay, so there's the wire cutter. Um, I'll take the screws. There is the piston. To get more machines, you'll need pistons, but not amateurish ones. You need special ones. And I will shall guide you through or guide you in the making of them. So here we go. I'm going to have to go farm up some more iron for sure. Um, now the gear. How do we make these now? Usually it was just a hammer. So two rods, like usually they like kind of make sense the other, I guess, like you're cutting, like what are the rods for? Like how is that shaping it? Like you're hammering the two rods between, are you? Yeah, I don't know. I need two, don't I, for the, yeah. Carpenter's blocks. Is that what the piston is made of? Hmm. Yeah. As we can see, it's so much easier to make later. So what are these carpenter's blocks? So that's a thing. So two screws. If I do two screws and six, I get eight. And then better screws get you more. That's kind of cool. So I guess let's, oh, I can just use those screws that I just got, right? So how do we make these wood frame box? So wrench, hammer, wrench, wrench and sticks. Let's get some more of that. Right, wrench. So I need two pistons, so I would need, what, six of these? So I only need to do one of these crafts for now. Let's uh, 
Holy cow, is my inventory getting crowded? Put this away. Let's put some of this away. At least for now. Okay. So, Carpenter's Blocks is the thing, and then this in the middle. Where those screws go? There they are. Alright, so there is the Carpenter's Blocks. Red alloy plates, I'm assuming it's just the usual. Cobblestone have fence and then piston fences. I don't know if I've ever actually made fences yet. So we got sticks and wood, or we can add a couple screws and you get more. And then obviously better screws. Well, that one's that recipe's messed up. But yeah, the better screws you get more. So if I did two steel, I could get six out of that with carpenter's blocks. So it seems like the carpenter's blocks are almost like Oh, I see what that is. Got you. Carpenter's blocks are almost like an upgraded version of the planks. All right, so I can kind of see how that's... That's kind of cool, actually. It's like a higher tier. Um, so I need two. I don't particularly want to use the... The carpenter's box, though, because I need them. So what was that? Was that that home? Yeah. So there is my two fences. And then piston. Keep forgetting you can go to the recipes through the book. So what is this? Small iron or any wrought iron? Yeah, you can use wrought. They're interchangeable. And then... What's different between these? I don't know. Why is there five recipes for that? I didn't really see any difference. Anyway, will this actually go in? It will. So there is the piston. Don't I need like two of them? Hmm, I don't have... Well, it's giving me two pistons right there. How awesome is that? Shit. Well, I'm going to reuse them right away. Yeah, I'll use the sticky pistons. I don't know. And it gave me more carpenter's box. So it definitely lessens the... Uh, the quest definitely kind of help lessen the grind. So that is very cool. I like that a lot. So now what do we got? So there is the compressor. So that's cool. Um, still living in a dirt hut. How do you know? How about letting in some sunlight, grind up some sand and flint and craft some glass dust, put it in your smeltery and pour it into a casting basin to make clear glass in order to use it for recipes, you have to chisel it. All right, so I don't have a smeltery yet, so can't do that. To make your first mace do you need two diamonds. And to answer the twilight forest, you need one. Finding a diamond vein would help you a lot. Go and look at when it's level 5 to 20 and I have actually found I have found one so I left out on that it's I think it's in this one I think so it's almost like right next to my base but I'm going to be building um but let's go ahead and let's get the steam compressor and then we will probably finish up this episode um, at that. So we got, this is pretty easy. I have my two pistons I already got. Um, you can use either of them. These are six ingots and this is eight. So I just need a bunch of bronze. And I'm going through these hammers like crazy. So I need my eight for the thing and then six more for that. So hammer. 
yeah, bronze hull. So there is that. And then, what was it like that? That. So let me just double check. Yeah, small bronze pipes. And that should be that. Nice. So there is that. And oh, that opened up a lot of stuff. These check uh, clipboards are actually pretty cool. Um, all right, so this is, look at this. Do you feel lonely and need some extra protection for your base? Want to keep the pig one off your back and then other craft some iron golems? Monster problem inside your base will be gone. I don't have any snow, but I haven't exactly researched or I haven't explored very much. <laughs> the bookshelf can only be made with wood planks, which are made in a compressor. Perhaps someone thinks this is a bit crazy. All right. So, yeah, this is where we want to go for the forge hammer, which is the next machine that I want to do. So, oof, 10 blocks of iron. I'm curious why it wants two anvils worth. Did I miss see the recipe? No, that only needs one anvil, and I actually have a piston already. So, I don't know. We will see, but I need to craft up a bunch of... Or I need to go farm up a bunch of um, iron. But in the meantime... Now, these are bigger, right? Yeah. And these are the small, and these are regular. Why don't I I'm gonna do this? I'm going to replace these. And eventually I'm going to replace these as well, I think. But uh, for now, we'll just kind of leave that. I just want to get it hooked up. So there's that. It should have steam in it, which it does. Steam compressor. Let's move the output to up top, and then I can throw nine iron in there, and that will get me my yeah, it will get me my um. The compressor blocks. Okay, I'm going to take that out actually because I'm wasting steam here. I don't have a whole lot of materials here. And almost there, almost there. There we go. So there's my block of iron. Um, so yeah, I think we made some decent progress. We got some redstone going and some more machines. Um, but next episode, definitely want to get the four hammer crafted up, and uh, we'll see where we go from there. Um, I also might build out some more of my uh, platform, because I just found out I can actually craft stone wands. Alright, but that's going to be it for today, so thanks for watching, and have a good one.